NXT UK for all the people that work there. Yes, it's. I'm. I'm. I'm, I'm believe me, I, there's a bit of my heart fell on its side this week that, that those people had to let go. But for five for five months in lockdown in England, not one of them had to worry about a paycheck. Did That's they get a pay? For sure. Did they get a paycheck off any of these other companies? Probably not. Right. For five months in lockdown, six de- six hours a day, five days a week, I was doing with myself, Johnny Moss, John, uh, Robbie Brookside, James Mason. We're doing sc- what we call skull sessions, watching old British wrestling and breaking it down. And, and not only British wrestling, but American wrestling, breaking it down on Zoom calls. Mm-hmm doing whatever we could to make them better wrestlers. Did any of these other companies do that for you? So if they want to try try and take me up on this, take me up on it. And if I get fired from the company I'm working for now for sticking up for, then so be it. Because NXT UK was a passionate project of mine to give a decent place for British and European talent to get a pipeline so they could go to WWE and have the the charm life that I've had from it. And if they don't like that, they can get stuffed. And if they want to take me up on that, make sure they know what they're doing. Because if they want to find out how, how, how much I can, they don't want to know. Away. You're addressing the notion that so I've seen and some people put out there that NXT UK somehow damaged the <laughs> the the scene out there. And what you're saying is that the talent was out there, but the scene, as far as the supporting structure to pay these people, wasn't really. They wasn't... were all having to work. They were all having to work loads of little shows and sell merch with no no pipeline to get into a big like right now there's AEW so they can there's a if any of the young talent now there's two there's two places that they can go or get a chance to go but at, at that time there was no there was WWE or New Japan and there wasn't really a process in place for getting UK wrestlers you know of course right. you had and I know because I've lived it right right, right. It was a, a a process of getting a chance. Not everybody's going to make it. It's, it's wrestling. Not everybody's going to have a, have a good story. Not everybody's going to have a good time. That's not just wrestling. That's entertainment. It's life. It's life. Mm-hmm. Right? I, well, love, that- I love Motorhead. In England, Motorhead are... are and Europe and Japan, Motred are the thing. In America, Motred, well, let me live, dear. And they were putting, unless they were on tour with somebody as a support act, they were putting a few hundred people in a club. And yet they're the most influential band of, of all what became heavy metal bands. Mm-hmm. Right. It's... These people who want to live in this nonsense world, right? And that they don't get the bigger picture because they live in this wrestling bubble and they, they listen to all this crap because nobody... I live in a town which is full of CNM people because I work, used to work for Turners. Right. Right? I know a lot of them. Until 9-11, stop me if I've ever said this on this show before, until 9-11, I used to see them at the, the local s- supermarket or the gas station, and I'd say, what's happened today? And this is CNN. This is the right. liberal people, right? Right. And they go, nothing. We have to make it up. <laughs> and it used to bother me. Because I've grown up in England with tabloid journalism. They sure. will build people up to break them down quickly. Right. right? 
the same people after 9-11, I saw one of them one day over at the gas station, which is 45 minutes, uh, 45, sorry, 45, less than a quarter, uh, three quarters, sorry, three quarters of a mile away from my house. And I said to him, oh, that's terrible. And he went, it's great. We don't have to make anything up. Wow. And it's been that way ever since. Whenever I see these same people, oh, because there's a war going on. Right. Because, because if you actually knew what was going on in wrestling every day, there's nothing happens in wrestling. <laughs> I'm sorry to all these people who make a living off it, but there's nothing happens in wrestling. It's just another day at work. Well, it is if you're me. Right. If you're a gossip queen, then it's 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 a lot. Of, it's all kinds of things. It's really what's that thing? Chicken, whatever. The world's falling down. Right. Right. 